This is going to be a quick video to show you how to work with colors, color fills, and strokes in Affinity Publisher. This is Affinity Publisher version 2, and it will also work in version 1 similar. So I'm just going to create me a document, and first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to create a couple objects here. So we we'll just go with the ellipse tool create an ellipse tool here or an ellipse and then I'm just going to create me a triangle down here so let me show you a couple different things here now to work with fill colors come over here you know you got a color wheel and this is the object that we're selecting so we want to click onto this circle and we can just roll it around or we can double click up here and get the color uh, panel and we can choose any color we want and you see we could do that down here as well and up here we can click on this and we could also come up here and do the same thing so that's uh, three different places to mess with the color now let's go with the stroke so let's just click on this we got the stroke here and right now it says that there is a black stroke but you really can't see it so we're going to go to stroke panel we're going to increase it so you can see it there we go and we can go here we can remove that stroke by simply clicking that or we can just go ahead and go back and let's just put it back on there and of course this can be done up here as well and of course your stroke panel you can do a few things in there it's like I already showed you, you can we're going to shrink that down a little bit okay so that's how no to get no fill you could do the same with this you click on that no fill and we'll just go back we'll just click here and give it back its fill now let's say we wanted to resize this if we resize it, you'll notice that the stroke is not resizing. It's just staying the same the whole way. So what do we do about that if we want the stroke to resize or constrain with the object itself? We go to Stroke Panel. We click on Scale with Object. Now watch what happens. You'll notice the stroke scales with the object. And one more, last thing I want to show you about the color here is you have a color picker here. Just click off here you have a color picker here you can pick any color you want in your document go here we're going to select here we're going to get this object here we have the fill on top here we're just going to click on that it's going to change that and just take your color picker we can go here make sure this is selected click the dot and there we go so that's all there is to working with strokes color fills and if this has helped you, how about leaving a thumbs up, subscribe, leave a comment. You have a good day.